Hey everybody, Ken Surfs here, and we are at Waikiki Beach, Hawaii. And I'm going to be doing a shave from the lanai, or the balcony. And uh, hope everybody's doing good. I had planned, uh, there, there's a lot of new viewers out there, and I keep forgetting about that. And, uh, you know, I did a, a shave with a Mach 3 cartridge razor the other day. And uh, generally I use uh, DE blades and DE razors. And somebody said, hey, is there like something in between? Because the cost of cartridges are expensive. And there's several choices out there. And one of the choices that uh, I really enjoy is from uh, Leaf Shaving. And this is, well, there's the stand. This is the twig. And it takes a half of a DE blade. You uh, open this up, it turns, and you take a DE blade. I'm gonna do that right now. If it's noisy, I apologize. By the way, this is what the view looks like. been raining out here so uh, 80 degrees and rain <laughs> light rain all right here we go I'm taking a DE blade and I'm gonna fold it like this and snap it listen here it snap there we go then I'm gonna take one half of it and this is a Wilkinson sword Gillette blade I'm gonna take one half of it and I'm gonna put it right there See that? Then I'm going to close this. And there you go. So they actually have uh, this leaf, leaf shaving also has uh, uh, a bigger razor that takes three blades. So you almost get like a Mach 3 type shave. Now they have this month only. Uh, go to their site, check it out. It's called Berry Blue. Uh, the color is just a beautiful blue and I had ordered one from them and they sent it to me and it arrived an hour after I had left for this vacation so I have not had a chance to try the berry blue out and the blue razor is just killer looking it really take a look if you're ever thinking about getting something like this take a look at the berry blue they're selling out This is the twig. It's for kind of like a very mild, mild beards like I have. And then they have the thorn, which is for a little more aggressive for like a thicker beard. And then they have the regular leaf razor, uh, which is a pivoting head. And it'll take three half blades like that. I brought my cool shaving kit from Parasso. You have the cool <laughs> Parasso brush. In fact, I got some hot water right here. I'm going to soak this in here while we're sitting. It's a bore. Soak that in there. I've got my uh, shaving cream. I'm going to have to do a face lather. Here comes the sun now. I'm going to have to do a face lather. And I've got the aftershave balm. And I have a little pre-shave. So let me wet my face a little with this water here. Just came from a swim. <laughs> Was just swimming. Went to the North Shore of Hawaii today and ate at Matsum Matsumoto's famous shaved ice on the North Shore of uh, Oahu. And, uh, well, here's me. Yeah, it was kind of fun up there, really nice drive. You can tell I just came out of the water. All right, a little pre-shave. Again, it's so hot here, my face is drying before I can even get this, uh, get this on. All right. Oh, Parasso pre-shave menthol. Really nice. Had a hell of an adventure getting here. The good folks at Hawaiian Airlines, I booked this trip in August of last year. And Hawaiian Airlines, their system was going down for service. So when I tried to Red, or check in for the flight 24 hours ahead, their system was down. So I called them up and I said, hey, can I log in now? And they said, no, you have to go to the kiosk, just go to Long Beach Airport, log in right there. 
They didn't tell me that that flight had been canceled. I uh, five, got there at 5.20 a.m. They tell me the flight's been canceled. We sent you an email. I did not receive an email. And, uh, but they were apologetic and they're gonna credit me a flight. So now I've got the hotel, I've got my father-in-law, I've got my wife, we're heading out. I had to buy tickets that day for Southwest, leaving out of Long Beach at 11.50. Here's where the story <laughs> is gonna get good. Hang on, let's wet this. See, you get a shave and a story. Long Beach is working on their airport. They're repaving their long runway. Their airplane that come to Hawaii is a little bigger than the airplanes they generally use to fly, you know, uh, in the U.S., uh, mainland. So the runway, they're using the short runway. The plane's too heavy with all the passengers in the bags to take off. I mean, I get in that airplane at, uh, they, they, and then they delayed it too. So I get in that airplane at uh, 12 noon, we're supposed to leave at 12.50. Four hours sitting on that plane on the tarmac. Luckily I was in row four. Uh, terrible, terrible. Until 21 passengers volunteered to leave and with their luggage and the plane was able to take off at four. I sat four hours on that plane, five hours on the flight, got here. Dude, I was beat. All right, let's see if I can do this. I'm using the mirror or the uh, phone as a mirror here. So it was a hell of a time getting here. But the view was worth it. But I'm definitely contacting Southwest and saying, hey man, four hours, didn't you know that uh, you should have known that you can't take off on a short runway. Shouldn't have had us sitting there for that length of time. But, you yeah, know, it is what it is. Here we are. Man, the leaf works really well. The twig, the twig works really well. Very, very economical. Doesn't clog. But berry blue. I mean, I like this color, but man, berry can't wait to try it. And it just arrived, like I said, after I had left. It didn't matter because I sat on that damn airport for, I mean, I won't talk about it no more. It gets me angry. <laughs> All right. Very nice. All right. Going out tonight with the wife and father-in-law gonna go uh, see a show here in the hotel have to add a little more mm, a little more there we go again I'm looking at the reflection in the phone so it's very hard to tell it's not like a mirror in the bathroom But you don't get shaves on lanai's or balconies too often, right? All right, and I'm just rinsing this out like this. There we go. So if I miss a spot, like I said, my views or my phone's not the greatest mirror. What an adventure! Probably never fly Hawaiian Airlines again. Sorry, but man, I can understand if they sent an email and I didn't see it. That's on me. But my father-in-law canceled my, you know, my mother-in-law passed away and uh, she had her ticket. And about two weeks ago, he called up and says, "Hey, she's not going to be able to make it on the flight." And they canceled her. They didn't tell him then. And then uh, when I tried to check in, they didn't tell me. So that's on them. But I've got credit.
right now we're ready to go. Guess what I forgot? A towel. Hold on. The sun's really coming out now. That's the Hilton Hawaiian Village right there. Behind me. Man, the sun is really coming out now. All right. burn. I wouldn't want to have a burn right now anyway. <laughs> Not here. All right. So that is the twig and check it out in Berry Blue. You won't regret it. I'm telling you, you will not regret it. And I'm going to have another shave uh, coming up and I'll be showing you some sights from the trip. All right. So until next time, it's Ken Searcy. Shave on and have a great night. Bye for now.